is Hans the Ramen Raider coming at you with another episode of Instant Noodle Recipe Time, the show where I show you what to do with your instant noodles. And today I've got one from China. This is uh, one I found at 99 Ranch Market. Somebody requested I do this one. I'm pretty sure they wanted this one. This is the Baixiang Artificial Chicken Soup Flavor. And I've liked these Baixiang varieties for a long time. Um, 500 mils of water, right? No, 600. That's right, 600. Where's the little thing? Uh, uh. Oh, I know it's 600. That's what I've got in the pot, not what I read on the pack, so. Well, I'm not going to second guess myself on this. Because that would be foolish. Look at that big liquid sachet. Wow. Veggies. I'm making a big mess. I'm do it like this. So this will be a three minute. There's our big noodle block. And then we've got our vegetables. So I'm just going to try to crank out three episodes today. Wish me luck. Alright. There we go. And, uh, yeah, we do that for three minutes. The, the vegetables in there. And then when it's done, you stir in the other sachet. And from what the guy was saying, it's a good one. So, sounds good to me. I'll give it a try. I've liked their stuff before, so why not? So, it's one of those days. Any of you folks have student loans? Man. So, I went to college for a short period of time, and uh, I really enjoyed it. However, they were more than happy to give out student loans left and right. But then again, of course, I was more than happy to go get them when we needed to make rent at the time. And so every quarter I was getting some kind of loan. and. It, it got pretty big. Not not like doctor big. But, uh... And then I've come to find out that you can't just get, like, Pell Grants and junk like that forever. If you're... If you don't... They only give you so many credits. That, I will say... The one thing, if you're going to college... Know that. Okay? Because... Just know that unless you're... Unless you got like a full boat scholarship or this or that or whatever, it's a pain in the butt to navigate the seas of the financial aid department. It's horrible. Absolutely freaking horrible. And it's ridiculous. They've got students in there, don't know what they're doing, give you a different answer every time you talk to them. This is how the school makes their money. You know? So, I mean, all that money you're getting in on financial aid. Oh, that's going to the books that are, that are, like, violently overpriced. I remember one quarter I had three classes and the books were, like, 400 bucks. I'm not kidding. And they were, like, one of the one of the classes we had to get, like, these two books. We didn't even use them. Just, like... Anyways, that's enough about my woes. Let's have some wisdom. Momo Fuguendo. So... Let's 
este... I'm gonna go with 235. Ask yourselves whether fear of failure isn't making you unwilling to stir things up. I did that one yesterday. The next one is 236, I Dislike Sectionalism. By all means, cross over into other people's territory. Okay, there you go. So that's, that's the quote of the day from the guy who invented the instant noodle, Momofuku Ando. Also, you could call him Ando Momofuku-san, which would make more sense. Oh, ah. Let's check this one out. Oh wow, that felt pretty good. got a nice smell to it. It smells like chicken. The pork one, see what happened is what a while back, I saw this one and I was at the store and I got it. And you can only get it like in five packs, right? Well, I got, got it and I thought I was getting a chicken and a pork one. They were both pork. So I had like 10 packs of noodles. Of course, I'm only gonna use one of them. But then somebody asked about the chicken one, and as it happens, that evening, I was at the Asian grocery, and right there, there it was. So I'm like, okay. Let's give this broth a try. That is quite good. That is very good. It's not overly salty. It's just got a very nice, rich, rich, and it's got a nice thickness to it. And just strong, oily chicken flavor. It's very nice. Let's try these Baishang noodle. Yeah, that's solid. That's very good. Congratulations. You guys make pretty good news. Okay, let's get you situated. So they're doing, what are they calling, like bridge week? I don't know what week they're basically it's all back to school but like in person if you're okay with your kids going back to school in person we're not yet but they've they've like you know they've only got so much staff that's that's understood so there's things that are a change in Try this piece of vegetable that's stuck to the bottom of the bowl. Not bad. Crisp. She made eggs last night, and these are farm eggs from her co worker. Thank you very much.
that color. Wow. Yeah. Um. Hey, my wife's coworker. Can we just hit you up for eggs from now on? Cause that. Look at that. Wow. There's they, they the eggs were all sorts of different colors themselves. There was like really deep reddish ones and kind of bluish ones and stuff. I'm guessing this is one of the big red ones. I don't know. That is a lovely looking egg. So, baked some chicken with some seasoning that I found this last weekend. So I'm very happy that I did. Good stuff. Chicken. Spring onion. Wanna go with the black? No. I can keep it light and lively. By the way, um, this is one of those new bowls. I really like these. So look in the description below if you're looking at YouTube and it'll have a link to these. Because these are rad. And some chili flake. Yeah. How about, yeah, that way? No, that way, yeah, no, yes. Yes, 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 yeah, yeah, yes, yes, yes. All right, let's let Rotato make its beautiful magic. Well, folks, an absolutely exceptional chicken instant noodle variety. Thanks to Dude for asking if I had had this or, or telling me to have it. I like it. It's been Hans the Ramen Raider wishing you enjoyment of your noodles each and every day. The one you'll see next will be... Drum roll, please. Hold on. Pond ramen noodle soup. Bye. Right? Bye.